They made $907. That is a three times return on your money in seven days. That's unheard of. Good day, Airbnb Nation. I am Danny and right this video, I'm gonna take you behind the scenes in what I do in order to measure the success of the products that I sell. The two products I'm referring to are Superhost Optimization and Elevate Host Optimization. Both links will be in the description here. Superhost works on your online listing only. The point is to rank you higher in search and make you immediate, an immediate search rank boost and immediate income. Elevate is that plus increase of guest experience, automation of certain things, a lot of extra stuff goes into Elevate Host. But on both of those, I still measure the revenue. How much revenue did you make? Can I attribute to my optimization? And why do I attribute it to my work? Is because I only measure the next seven days. I do my work, I measure seven days after. That's a hell of an ROI. So I attribute that to my work. Okay, so keep that in mind. We're gonna go through row 15 here. Okay, Luke's, uh, Luke's account. Now this, uh, it is today, so I did this on, I finished this on October 6th at 6 p.m., 18 o'clock. Today is October 13th at 11.30 a.m. Okay, so it's been a week later. So now this is the this is the nightly rate. I measure this before I get started. So $204 average nightly rate over the next 90 days estimated by me. How much availability does this host have in the next 90 days? If there's zero, probably we're not gonna see any income because there's no days to book. Most reservations are being booked in the next 30 days. If there's 90, it doesn't necessarily mean we're gonna see more income. It could be a bad listing. It could be a bad location. It could be a bad, uh, the, the service the host provides could be bad. It could be low season. There's a lot of variables that goes into this. So just as long as it's more than about 45 days, there's enough availability where the, the probability is equal. If you have 90 or 45, or if, you know, even like maybe maybe 35, that's getting a little rough. Then the probability of earning it, making this an investment. These are investment products, by the way. You're paying me, and I'm doing work, and you're going to see an investment within seven days, a return on investment in seven days, which in the investment world is unheard of to measure it on such a short time span. All right, this is how much revenue they made, current revenue they made as of October 6th, and how much future revenue that will be coming in as of October 6th. Okay. Let's go over to the host's account now. And here is their transactions. Let's go to October. Now the current money revenue they made in October is $2,159, $2,159. Now that makes sense. I don't know whether or not my optimization worked. Uh, that, what that means basically is the future revenue a week ago, some of it is current revenue today. All right, and then we go to upcoming payouts and it looks like $6,396. $6,396, okay? And what is that? What, there is an increase there of $2,440, okay? So from the time that I did my optimization until seven days afterwards, the host made $2,440. Now that's cool. I'm happy with that, right? I'm happy with that. But I measure this, this I don't, I used to advertise this number, I don't anymore. What this means here is, uh, the host made 1,196% of their nightly rate. Formula is here. Okay, nightly rate 200, 2,400, okay. All right, now that's great and I'm happy with that, but there's something even more important than that. This number here tells me how much money did the host earn in the seven days prior to my optimization? And how do I do that is I click on every, before I get started, I click on every one of these reservations and I look to see if, if it was booked within the seven days before my optimization. So in this case, September 30th to October 6th, something like that. And in this case, for this host, of that $6,115, $1,533 of that was booked in the seven days prior to my optimization. Okay, so let's compare how much uh, they made. So it looks like there was, there was an increase. Bam, $907. So what this is telling me, I'll open up the calculation. The, the money that they earned, the seven days after optimization, $2,440. But they earned without my help, seven days before optimization, $1,533. So really, I only take credit for $907. Superhost optimization is $300. They made $907. That is a three times return on your money in seven days. That's unheard of. No, I'm not trying to overvalue what's going on here. The video will be back shortly, but Reishi and Luna really had something to say.
Uh, this is just for me to know, hey, am, you know, I make bold claims. I'm Say I'm the best in the world at Airbnb. And I hope I prove that over and over again with the content I produce, with the videos that I produce, the blog I just wrote, with the apartment that I just bought, the apartment that I just bought. I, I'm going to be, you know, this is my first home. I call myself the best in the world. It better be damn good, right? So uh, let's have a look at that, by the way. All right, so this is not live. This is not yet live, but this is a beginning of my listing that I will be posting ew, in the next, it might be out when this video comes out, it might be out. Here, I'm gonna put, uh, like I said, it's not live. Uh, I'm logged in so I can see it, but I'm gonna put this link in the description so you can, if, if it's not yet live, you can save this, you can favorite this uh, into your um, browser. And when you come back, uh, you can keep your eye on this. This is gonna be highly optimized, as optimized as you can get. So if you wanna be the best in your market, you're gonna wanna pay attention to this. Now there's a lot of subtleties but it is what it is. All right, so uh, let's move back here. I hope that all makes sense. So this is what I do with every optimization I do. I come in seven days after, I, I measure the revenue before I come in seven days after. I also look at the listing and make sure everything is, is still optimized and looking well. And then I measure this number. And when I see it like this, I'm very happy. It means my work is successful. It means I'm doing good work. It means I've made the host money. At least that's how I see it. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, if you would like more information on Superhost or Elevate Host, then um, please click the link in the description. This is not a sell. This is not a sales video. I'm not trying to sell anything. Don't buy because of this video. Okay? Do not buy because of this video. In fact, I've said this numerous times. I'm not really here to even make money. By default of being the best in the world at Airbnb, I make money. People pay me. People do pay me. But um, I don't pay for ads or anything like that, and so that's reflected in my revenue. I don't make a lot of money. But I really enjoy doing this. I enjoy what what you can do better than even paying me is what you can do is things like communicating to the world who I am. Because right now I'm a little fish. No, not many people know about me. Only a few lucky Airbnb hosts know about me. And if you don't wanna save me for yourself, what you can do is you can do things, free things, like liking this video, subscribing to my channel, even better than that, if you wanna take it a step further than that, sharing this video or any of my videos or my channel in general on Facebook groups, on Twitter, on social media, anywhere, signing up for my newsletter. I'll add a link in the description here. That will, uh, that will be tremendously valuable. Uh, going to my website and reading my, web, my blog posts. And if you wanna take it a step above commenting on those, that tells Google, hey, this guy's, this guy's got an interactive readers that are actually really interacting with that, that's a good sign to Google. So that will help me rank higher in Google search because I do spend a lot of time, a lot of time on these blog posts and on this business as well. Luckily, I like doing it, like I said. Um, and honestly, I would much rather you spread my information rather than rather than um, pay for a super host or elevate host because all of the tricks, they're not really tricks and secrets I do, are online. They're all available, they're all on my blog. You can learn everything if you have the time. Now that's a caveat. If you have the time, don't pay me. Just learn it yourself. That's better. If you don't have the time, then yes, you can you can exchange your money for time, and I'll do it for you. Okay. I hope this uh, video. Uh, I get a lot of questions about like about this stuff. Uh, I did a case study as well. I'll link the case study here, so you can click that now and read a case study uh, of this uh, more in depth with pictures and everything. Or uh, leave a comment on this video. I really appreciate you giving me some of your time and watching this video. Maybe you were thinking about buying it, and this gave you some more confidence to go ahead with the purchase. Uh, I don't know, but I hope. At the very least, you enjoyed it. Until next time, happy hosting. And of course, any suggestions you have for future videos, throw them in the comments and I will probably do them.